things that nature gave us the ability to see. But what is color and how do we see colors? Hi everyone, my name is Ina Behri and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about how do we see colors. But first, let's take a look at what light is. Light is electromagnetic radiation, meaning that light is made of electromagnetic waves. Each electromagnetic wave can have a wavelength from 10 to minus 16 meters to 10 to 8 meters. And to each wavelength, a color is attributed. As you can see, lights that have wavelength from 10 to minus 16 meters to 10 to minus 12 meters are called gamma rays. Lights that have wavelength from, to, from 10 to 7 meters to 10 to 8 meters are called radio waves, and so on. This classification is what gives us the electromagnetic spectrum. We can distinguish between gamma rays, X-rays, infrared, ultraviolet, microwaves, and radio waves. But we humans can only see a tiny part of the electromagnetic spectrum, and that would be light that has wavelength from 400 nanometers to 700 nanometers. It goes from red to violet. This is called visible light. Let's move on now to the process of seeing colors. When light, let's say coming from the sun, hits an object, the object absorbs some of the light and reflects its rest, depending on its properties. The light that is bounced back is what determines the color or the colors you will see. Let's say that you're looking at a tomato. You see it red, right? Well, it is because the light that this tomato reflects is red. So the light that is refracted will enter your eye and get your retina. Your retina contains two types of light receptors roads and cones. Roads are responsible for your darkened view, and as you know, you cannot see colors in dark, which means that cones are the ones allowing you to see color, considering that they are responsible for your lightened view. There are three types of cones, cones for red light, cones for green light, and cones for blue light. So when the red light coming from the tomato gets to your retina, it will be detected by your cones, especially the ones for red light. Then those cones will create a signal and send it to your brain to be processed. Therefore, you will see a red tomato. You might ask yourself, how do we see colors apart from red, bl green and blue? Well, I got the answer. We classify colors into two types, primary colors, which are red, green and blue, and additive colors, which are all the other colors. Let's take for example yellow. Yellow is a mixture between red and green, so to perceive a yellow object, both of your red and green cones are working together. 